hello friends welcome to the my youtube channel in this video i will show you how to record the audio or how to record the voice by use of qt application or how to use qt multimedia feature to record the audio so let's write the code include multimedia feature Qt multimedia Qt core and Qt widget and Qt GUI okay now let's create the object of Q audio recorder Also create the one object of Q audio prop to monitor the recording audio. Now let's assign the memory of Q audio recorder. Also assign the memory of Q audio probe. Now let's set this source of audio probe. Now let's create the audio encoder setting class object to setting the or set the audio audio settings like codec codec type, sample bitrate, or channel count and many more settings. Okay, now let's just set the first of all codec. audio slash PCM also set the sample rate 0 set bit rate is also 0 set channel count is minus 1 these all are the parameter is basically configure as my microphones which is connected with my system now here let's set the quality of our recording audio qt multimedia encoding quality set the very high quality also set the encoding mode here you have to pass or set the encoding encoding mode q multimedia constant quality encoding now also set the container audio container which is audio x w a v or also you can set audio less x less r a w ok option 2 now here we have to set the output location where our audio file is saved so set output location qurl from file let me pass the for set the path
write your file name let me write it qt with ktan dot wav okay and set the encoder setting which is pass your container of okay now let's add one button to start the recording and stop the recording Set one flag is recording start equal to false. You write the condition for start and stop. Basically, simple one flag. Now here we write your start and stop code. A record call record function to record start the recording and call the stop function to stop the recording. Okay. Now change here your button name, button text. Now let's also add one label control to display the duration how much our voice was recorded LBL set your object name label duration for that let me let's add one signal and slot function void update progress q in duration Here we have to connect our signal and slot with Q audio recorder class. Just simply write or call the signal which is duration change. Okay, and call the our slot when duration change signal is emitted update progress now here write the slot code if audio recorder there is a no any error for recording error is not equal to q media recorder equal to no error and duration value is less than one second we can also set your limitation then return return from this function otherwise just simply display the duration okay. 
echo dead audio time is just simply divided duration value divided by 1000 second Okay, now let's run the our application. Okay, let's convert the value here integer to number string. Sorry. So I am going to play one sound in my mobile and which is recorded. So simply open the now start the recording. So let's stop the recording. So you can see file is successfully created and our voice or audio is recorded successfully. Just simply change here label size to display proper. Okay, now let's play the recorded audio file. So you can see our voice is recorded successfully. Now let's run the application again and play one more simple sound. Remove this file and start the recording. So you can see. The timer is started. Let's stop the recording. So 33 seconds is recorded. Now let's play the file. So you can see here to the duration of the so file. See. And also you can listen the recorded audio. So by this way we can easily record the audio or voice. So thanks for watching my video please drop your comment if you have any question and please like the video if you like it and subscribe my youtube channel and share this video with your friends and thank you.